Hello, my lovely Capricorn. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Capricorn, today we'll do your reading for the 15th and the 16th of January. As you know, loves is a general read. May resonate with you, may not. Take it accordingly. Sun, Moon, Rising signs and Venus signs for the sign of Capricorn. Let's see here, loves, what we have from the Lenormand Gilded Reverie. What's the message? What's the advice? And also we'll do our reading and our spirit guides messages towards you. If you Capricorn, I am invited here to see this reading by any means, by the title, or you feel just drawn to see this video, it's a message here for you. And flip the characters, sometimes is not you, is the other person. If you feel so, flip those as is a general read. My, might be you, might be the other person. Sometimes I might pick health, sometimes, which is most of the time, is love. And sometimes I might pick career or money. Okay. Let's see here. What we got for you from the Lenormand? What's the energy around you from it? And how we're moving forward. Number nine. For some of you, I feel here there is some happiness around you. And I see... And I see a new beginning for some of you. Let's see here. Number nine. The flowers. Beauty and a happy face is what I bring. I am the gift that warms your heart. I am your recovering and your well-being. No matter what card is before, I will always change it positively. It is a very, very positive card. Absolutely. And we have the next card, the star. It's like you get what you really want. Keep doing the great work, Capricorns. Very, very great, very promising, very healing, very, very good vibes are coming towards you. Yeah. Let's see here what we got from the tarot. I feel here it is some joy in this situation. For many of you, there is definitely joy. For some of you, you are recovering from a health issue, like all the treatment go very good. For some of you who, who thought you will get not really well, it's turned out that things are better now, and it's kind of, it's at the end of something heavy and now starts the blessings to come let's see here capricorn capricorn sun moon rising signs and venus signs spirit give me some insights for the capricorns always know the predictions come sooner or later they always do and some predictions can be changed just the fact that you know they are coming you can avoid whatever situation is here there is a lover's situation here it is a decision it is a very strong connection between you two. For some of you Capricorns, you might deal with an Gemini. Could be another air sign. Let's see here. Could be a fire sign. Somebody, somebody comes towards you. And it's them who comes towards you. I feel here this... It is some regret here, whatever this person has been in the past with you or whatever they conducted themselves. But definitely they do love you. They love you. They are they have that passion. For some of you you deal with a fire sign and that fire sign could have another fire sign or vice versa but I definitely see here there is a message a call from this person it is an apology let's see here what you got here it's kind of you are passing through a heartbreak but you I feel here you didn't show that to everybody like you you suffered but deep inside but outside you 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 show everybody that you are good you're fine you might 
put yourself just work 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 because I see you very busy here also I feel for over two years for the Capricorn I'm talking here you you could distance for everything or whatever was there with with somebody it is a Libra here definitely Libra I see could be a Taurus I see a Virgo I see a Pisces and I see an Aries Leo Sag for some of you 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 let go a third party and you need a big big time of a healing let's see for some of you you you've been recovering from from a depression or this person had that and I see somebody who've been dealing with some drinking problems, money problems. And I don't feel it's you, loves. I feel it's the other person. One of these people who you were dealing was the, were having that problem definitely was a third party here in between and definitely you are at the distance right now from this person I don't feel you are together some of you you basically choose yourself and distance yourself from from two people What I see here, a Capricorn, a very spiritual person. And sometimes people are freaked out that you are very spiritual, that you are a true believer in spirituality or you practice something in here. And people basically, they cannot accept. I remember when I started my journey, a lot of people, especially close people, were very skeptical like why you do that and why is that and yes I do have a degree in medical field nobody knew that I'm going to do this and the tarot is my passion for life my guys my spirits it's whatever I dream back then 15 years 20 years ago I do now and I feel here for some of you the third party could be that it is a Capricorn very spiritual very into esoteric things and the other person feels like you you could even be married at one point with somebody here and that person feels like you you're not living in reality but I see here you have a job I see you you're working for some of you who are not into spirituality but want to know about the relationship here there are two people around you who will want to be with you and one of these two people could be married at some point with somebody or they still are married but not very very happy whatsoever but one of those people the other one is a single person very successful financially It's like I'm talking with a Capricorn who work for themselves, is an entrepreneur. Let's see here. Why the Three of Swords is here? Temperance. 
definitely healing. It's like you you follow a path. For Capricorn, I'm talking here. You follow a path who you pursue in another life in here. Like you 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 like more the outdoors. For some of you 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 are very for those of you who are not in spirituality you are very very much like work back and forth, back and forth. But it's like you doing constantly something. And people looking at you like what you're doing here. For some of you, you in the third party, a secret one, could be a dot at work, and that's that's over. Yeah. But it's somebody who you really loved or liked and wanted something stable or wanted to, to work things forward with them. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. For some of you, you, you have a fire sign here. And also, I definitely see here new beginnings for all of you Capricorns. They are endings and they are new beginnings. And they are happening now. For some of you, you've been through over two years. Who've been a situation here with somebody who you stand up for yourself. You've been for yourself. But that's over. For some of you, it's kind of like, I'm happy that it's over. Yes. It's kind of, if you've been married with somebody here, Capricorn, I don't feel you are around with this person. I don't see you very much engaging with them. It's like, whatever it is, it's just like, Kind of business. If you have kids together, you talk just about kids. Because it's distance here. This person is at the distance. Like, you don't really talk with them uh, like a friend. How you are, how you're doing, how's your day. No. It's like you're calling them and you just talk basics. It's a very basic situation. For, for those of you singles, Capricorn, I see you have a lot of people around you who want to be with you. Because it shows me here it's coming a new relationship. But it's kind of you are all over the place. And you want to, to stay stable. But you don't really know which one is the right one. Which person is the good one. For some of you, you end up leaving somebody and you're still processing that. I don't see you mo moved entirely here. For some of you, it's coming new love here. And commitment. If you want to take it, it is coming. And could start as a friendship. But it shows me here, could develop more. Whoever comes towards you. Okay? Shows, shows to me as a good relationship here. If you are thinking of a past person, I don't see them coming. Even they will come that relationship with that person will not go very, very well. But I definitely see here the new connections you build or you have or you make, they seem to me very, very good and long-term. 
for some of you I see you taking a trip later on it's like a, tr a work trip type and in that trip I will suggest to take more days for you just to take care of you or just like enjoy more time off for those of you who try to build a business I see here there's a lot of back and forth situation but I definitely see here you will work hard for quite a bit of time there are two three years in between that you will work very hard but I see you growing it's like a slow grow it's something you you want to grow fast but it's, it shows me here it's a slow and steady grow and if you are patient enough the fruits will be very great You'll be very happy that you never give up. You need to fight for it. Because I feel here there is a Capricorn who, who builds an idea, a business, or whatever you work for yourself or whatever hobby you have. You work hard for it. And at the one point, it's just like you feel like, I'm done and over this. What's bring me this? Is this good or not? But I feel here you, you will be prosperous of that. So yes, my loves, again, for those of you who somebody is coming from your past, they might apologize to you. I don't see that going further or will have a future or something beneficial to you. There is a new energy of something new comes towards you. But definitely you have a lot of people around you who will want to date you, who will want to be, you know, your partner. And one of them is really serious, even for marriage. Somebody really wants a real commitment in here. So yes, loves, this is what I got for you. And... Thank you for watching and being here on the channel. Many blessings to all of you Capricorns. And of course, we'll see you next time. Bye for now.